I can ever get there. Appreciate you guys watching. This is the first time I've used this app. So forgive me if it's taking me a second to figure everything out. All right, sweet. It's working, I think. Take me to the video, please. All right. All right, that looks better. A lot better. Appreciate for hanging in there. This app is working infinitely better. You can't hear me right. Anyone respond? Uh, I'm assuming the audio is working, so I don't want to turn my computer volume on. I forgot I changed his skills. I'm trying to get a better skill set on Kiner than what I had. Okay, I, it'll show comments up top on this app. Whoever it was that suggested this app, thank you. This one's working a lot better. So I think my pick'em streak of two could come to an end today. The Orioles are, or at least they were last I checked, beating up on Boston. All right. Let's start opening up those packs that I have. For club, I ended up... Uh, we finished in third. So I have a diamond pack from that. I contemplate using this app to record now, too since the stream is working pretty well. However, hmm, I'm noticing that the screen is cropped a little bit. So it's not showing everything, unless I'm just stupid. Yeah, I'm just stupid. I scrolled down a little bit on my computer. <laughs> Wendell, 49i, Meeks, 51 base. That has to be another uh, new record for badness. I'm not even going to worry about Kinsler because I'm never going to use that Kinsler. If you added me on Fortnite, I'll eventually get around to accepting it. I'm getting a little bit better. Appreciate it, Jack. 
Hubby Wubby. A lot of people were really happy about that skill change. Nope, nope, nope. That name change ticket. I know I was. Well, actually, I didn't care. I just took my old uh, name back when Mithril changed it to Ito Sushi 2. I don't know who my favorite player is right now. Probably Verlander. I know I like him. If only the Tigers would have kept Verlander, Scherzer, Price, Porcello. That would be a great rotation. I think that five bronze is one of the, hey Cameron, one of the, oh, sure, I meant to keep that crappy schwindle. That's one of the worst I've ever seen. My first prime, I think, was actually Justin Verlander for when I had the Tiger team. I don't know. I I think it's going to be Dodgers and Astros right now. But I think it'd be interesting to see the Mets make the playoffs. Because that rotation is solid. I think it'd be fun to watch. To watch a Yankees uh, Mets series again. Aguilar, that's the worst finalized uh, player in the game that I know of. <laughs> yeah, 91 wins overall. My best is 9, but that's with my Miami team. This team, I switch it up a little bit sometimes. My first prime was Verlander. Shortly after they've released the primes. He was my first grade increase too. Couple of tigers. Welcome, whoever that is, and I don't know what it says, but welcome. I'm not sure who's going to end up with the most home runs this year. No skill changes. I might use that skill reset on Pomeranz. I tried 7-2-7. Seven, seven, just because that's how the it came. It came 1-3-1. One, one, or 1-1-3 one, one, or whatever. 
best way to get team diamonds. There's really no best way. I was, the easiest is buying a grade increase and doing that. Team select packs, 1% chance, not good. You just need luck when you're starting off. What'd you get, Hudson? Like, I haven't gotten a, a Miami Team Diamond in ages. I got mine through auction, a lot of them. True. We're, if you finish full seasons, that's another good way. That's how I got my live Vasquez. I don't know. I got really lucky on that one. Considering I saw a diamond for it. Wang. I wouldn't mind Wang or Altuve just because. Or gold, I guess. Dyson, that's a lot of speed. I'm from West Michigan. That Taylor is probably good DH. Ah, Taiwan. Yeah, there's a lot of Taiwan. Players from Taiwan. All right. What do you mean, Donnie? I thought of playing different games from baseball. Like different baseball games or games that aren't baseball games. I'm hoping to get some silvers. Honestly, that's why I'm opening these. I haven't opened up any basics in a while. Huh. I guess I didn't realize Kinsler went to the Padres. Really? Only one? I play Fortnite. I've played some Call of Duty. Uh, ooh, there it is. I'm thinking about uh, doing some Gears of War when that comes out. Uh, FIFA 20... Probably the new Call of Duty. Um, are you referring to this stream? This stream I'm using the Omelet app that I was... Ref Someone referred. I'm just getting rid of these basics. Oh, you're the one who gave that told me. I'm using uh, the Omelet app you mentioned. I would think you'd recognize that live thing, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, if I didn't pull that vas that live Vasquez and Diamond, I probably would have increased them by now. I was so close to doing it before I got them, right before I got them.
I won a million dollar or million coin lottery the other day. I might have mentioned that before. Okay, that's good enough for that. I don't play too much clutch. If I play it, I'm playing it to finish the 400 runs or get the two skill change tickets. Oh, double play ball. Yeah, there's like I want to get uh, a Real Muto for my Miami team, but it hasn't been in auction or free agent in well over a month, couple months. So the best pull was my Vasquez, at least my team pull. I I pulled the my Benintendi from there. Uh, I've pulled like three or four of my current team diamonds actually from season rewards. But I mean, I've pulled Kershaw's, Grinkies, all the good stuff from season rewards too. Yeah, it's at the end of the inning. Yeah, honestly, clutch is probably my least favorite thing. I think I finished the event for today. That's just a pain. I don't know how they're going to make those double special training things obtainable. You cannot get vintage or prime from end of season rewards. Um, I'll I'll generally re-roll if it's not a team diamond, and I'll re-roll the first two no matter what. And then if it's the third or fourth one, well, I'll I'll take it on the third. Cause the time I got Vasquez, I re-rolled it after seeing two diamonds, so. Lately, I've been a lot less for prediction as a good skill. Yep. I do the 40 games. The rewards reset at noon, I think, Eastern. I mean, prediction's a good skill, but in the higher tiers and ranked... I think it's more counterproductive. Uh, when you get on base, cleaning up your mess activates, and that kills your team. So, I don't know. I just recently... I put my Benintendi in place of my Jackie Bradley Jr. Because he has car pred. And he has batting machine slugger, so. Yeah, I need to get him some skill change tickets. The best skills for a pitcher? 
the best skill is cleaning up your mess. But you need that comboed with last boss, untouchable, or pitching machine. Individually, though, cleaning up your mess isn't the best. How do I get so much money? Do you mean coins? If you mean coins, I farm tons of games every single day. All day. Yeah, it takes a long time to get the, the vintage you need. And right now I'm just saving all my vintage packs. It's Pitching Machine is a lot better than Golden Pitcher because probably how they coded everything. I don't think Golden Pitcher is a good skill at all. I have it as a third on my Sutton, so if it wasn't a third skill, I wouldn't keep it. I'll generally generally run between four and six. See, I got hurt again. Dang. Man, I was hoping that they could make a run. A tip for someone starting off. If you're able to use an, an old phone or split screen with the Samsung device, uh, you can earn multi earn more packs. Uh, I would play through wildcard seasons, get into later seasons to earn better rewards. Ace is not a good skill. Pitching machine is what ace should be. So. I don't know why. But. I th it might have something to do with stamina. They did beat Baltimore the past two days. So. You can't win every game. Uh, on a reliever, I would take boss over mess alone. If you split screen, you can play more than one game at a time. Verizon shouldn't be able to block Wi-Fi on your phone when you get a new phone. Because I use a bunch of old iPhones. I mean, yeah, if it's an old phone you don't care about. Probably wouldn't hurt to reset it. Ah, change up got me. I have the show. I just haven't played it much. I just don't know what I would do for content. And it's a little bit more difficult for me to create content that isn't just streaming for uh, PlayStation because I have to use my computer to run the recording software. Now, this is 2033. My son will go after my computer and pull on all the cords, so that really limits what I can do a little bit at times.
I don't. I don't mean if the, if a phone can run this game, then it doesn't matter what kind of phone it is. I would say table setter batting machine is not a great set. I mean, it's better than it could be, but I haven't used table setter much. Because it would only be a third skill for most of my players. Yes, you can. You can play on as many as you want. You just have to make sure you start the game and hit play. And then log in on your next device. As long as the game is going, you can start up a new one. I mean, if you pull a prime that's older, I mean, you would have to, <laughs> You there's nothing you can do until you get player upgrade tickets or duplicate primes if they don't have any in the game. Uh, you play the games. You lock, hit, When you're in the game, there's this auto button. If you hit that, the game will do it. Do everything on its own and you don't have to do anything. You can just let them let the game go. Like I would never take two pitches in a row. Or three. So that's how you fire multiple devices by putting it on auto and earning your rewards that way. You can't just sim them. You have to actually go into the game. It has to be played out either by you or the autoplay. Well, if you pull, if you're playing clutch hits and getting that, uh, uh, upgrade ticket every two weeks, I mean, that'll help. Honestly, I don't change my channel too much. Sometimes I'll go into 104, but that's about it. I'll hit and run. Yeah, anytime you can pull a... A prime diamond is pretty cool. What do you mean, how do combos work? Uh, winning streak mess is not a... It's not bad you just have to be in the lead for it to be any of any use for a reliever a closer yeah that's a great set yeah combos is 100% luck because, I mean, earlier I had that. I had a six diamond, one gold shuffle, and I pulled the gold. I mean, Vlad would be a good, a good legend. I wouldn't mind him being a legend. If it was my team, I do not wish any players for my team to be legend. Based on the fact that they're harder to pull. So, if it's a legend... You're not going to get it.
Um, how many vintage do you open to get the legends? The legends I got. I got one from a silver pack, just randomly. That was Sutton. So, that was just straight luck. I don't expect to get another one. Uh... And the other two came from Ultimate Vintage, which are better odds. I mean, I could pull Ted Williams. I could pull him today. I mean, it's not going to happen, but I could. I mean, you could get 100 Legends, but you're spending tons of money on packs and have insane luck. And there's no point in having 100 Legends. You only need, well, you can there's only one reliever, no catchers, so you're not going to be able to pull a full team of legends. Um, it doesn't hurt to upgrade silvers or golds if they are high-end silvers and golds that will be in your lineup for a little while. But if they're just placeholders, I wouldn't. The event? Uh, the events... The end rewards aren't bad. It's just the daily rewards aren't the best. I'm not sure when it comes to Prime Worthy players. They... I don't think they should have made any of the 13 to 19 uh, Primes. Or 13 to 18. Yeah, typical. It would be nice if you could see the stuff that used to be. Hell, I forgot I had this great increase reset. And let's see. 72, 69, 72, 68, 68, 66. It might be him. I don't care about them as much. 68. Ah, once you get them to 75, it doesn't let you do it. Why? Oh, I can level him up. Why is he? oh I put him in my league lineup to keep my S set to level up Pagan. I kinda wanna do Pomeranz, but I don't want him going down. I think I'll lean towards Kiner, because he is my lowest. Let's go up, please. And he did. All right, nearly perfect. Oh, I don't want to share the screenshot. Now go away. There. I have no idea what the chances are for Diamond League.
But yeah, that was a good reroll on Kiner. Three more power. Now I just need skills. I can get one of these still. That's a lovely, not really. Yeah, someday he's going to have a great skill set. And he's going to be a great addition to my my offense. Uh, I do not buy grade increases every month. I have no plans of buying a grade increase anytime soon. Yeah, the best skill set I had for Kiner and Arcade was when I had Head On and Machine. I would easily finish Division 1 every week. My dog is having a dream of some sort. I, I don't know, Arcade, it just hasn't been the most fun, in my opinion. It's, I only do it for the rewards. And then once I hit level 90 or 100 or whenever I'm done, I would only do it for the weekly clutch coins. Pippin. That stopped her. Trying to read comments. Yeah, I have no one to grade increase for my Boston team. That would be of any real use. I mean, I could increase Dom DiMaggio. There's only a chance it'd be a minor increase in the outfield for someone. Uh, prime low, he could be a sub when Kershaw goes down, or if anyone goes down and he goes up. But it's not worth it. Yeah, Gaddis had a, a signature this for Houston. I think I pulled it one time, a long, a long time ago. Yeah, eventually, eventually you will get something good. It's not if, it's when. It, My Miami team has terrible luck when it comes to getting packs. It's just all intermediates and basics. 
with the occasional silver and premium sprinkled here and there. Nothing new. Well, hmm. I, th I think I'm going to call it a day today. Uh, I'm going to try to do nine inning streams more often. I want to try to stream something every day, whether it be nine innings, Fortnite, or something else. Uh, I think streaming is good in terms of community interaction and just being there for if anyone ever wants to talk or just maybe learn something about something. I don't know. But let me check my pick on where am I at? 5960. Well, it looks like not tomorrow, but Tuesday I should have my signature pack. I use between four and six generally, but that's, I will go through two league, two league uh, ball refreshes. That's what I'll do. And then I'll generally stop. Sometimes I'll do a third when I have more stars. Like right now, I have 300, so I wouldn't do more than two. And since I'll get more stars from ranked tonight. Oh, Boston came back a little bit, 6-3. So maybe if Boston can somehow come back, I'll have my sick pack tomorrow. So... At yeah, 5960. If they don't, I'll be at 5990 from the event and my pick them choice. So let's hope for a uh, Red Sox comeback and I will have that tomorrow. So I thank you, Hi, Gio. Um, I'm calling it a day today, so I appreciate you guys watching. So, yeah, yeah, Gio, you'll be able to check out the stream in a little bit when it's done uploading or whatever. I don't know. Maybe you can view it right away. So, I'm also going to put in, uh, that I use my GI reroll. So if you missed that, it's in here too. It was a good one. So thank you guys for watching and I will talk to you guys tomorrow.